a small town with good ice cream and great hospitality. We sat down and enjoyed ourselves. The hospitality was unbelievable. This is a day in the life of Chico Chad, and I want to share it with you. This was 11 5 22. When you get older, you will go to Buick. Buick is when you're going to be a grandma. <laughs> <laughs> and that's true. Ice cream shop in the state, right here in Henderson. And Sh Shooties Sweet Treats. Ooh. Right up on Main Street. And we're going to go test it out, folks. And she Ch serves lunch, too. And you know how Chico Chad is. <laughs> we're going we're gonna to talk about it. What's your <laughs> Cindy. Cindy, thank you so much. Oh, check it out. All it's right. Worth, worth the trip. Shoots ice cream. Yeah, we heard you had the best ice cream in the state. Hey, that's what the neighbor said. I, I'm not making this up. This what this what your people are saying. Well, I'm here. I think I'm well then. Just kidding. <laughs> it works. <laughs> but I hate them to say that. So. What's your um? What's your special ice? What's your most sold ice cream? Well, I have eight flavors. Toasted almond fudge is the hot seller. Toffee crunch, maple nut. Those are all local favorites. And then I have some fun ones like huckleberry or. French silk pie, that's also good. What's a French silk pie? It's just like the pie, but an ice cream form. Never had French silk really? pie, you know. Never it's heard like of it. Chocolatey. Ooh. Kind of moosey? Yeah. <laughs> you like that? Just yeah. making up words, huh? No, no. I like it's that. like a chocolate mousse, I would say. So, do you make your ice cream? I do not. It's a Kemp's. I can eat Kemp's. Okay. <laughs> Otherwise, the huckleberry is a cross between a blueberry and a grape. Hmm. Or the cookies and cream has peanut butter, like a ribbon of peanut butter through it. There's a garbage right over the edge here. Chuck, hold your arm out. Okay. There we go. So let's take a gander, folks, and see what the ice cream looks like. Looking <laughs> delicious. Right? Looking delicious. <laughs> well, you never know. You never know who might who might stop by and want to get some ice cream. I think I will try just a small huckleberry. Okay. You want to do it in a cone or a cup? Cup it. Hey. What's your name? Sarah. Hi, Sarah. I'm Chico Chad. Hi, is this your shop? It is. How long have you been here? Just since January. Wow. What made you want to sell ice cream? Well, my very first job when I was 14 was in an ice cream place, and I've loved it ever since. Fell in love with it. Kind of, yeah. What's your favorite ice cream? Toasted almond fudge. Wow. Yeah. Do you like trying different flavors? I do. I grew up coming to this soda fountain pharmacy. Oh, that's good. Uh-uh. That's good? Yeah, I'm in. And the picture of what it looked like in the 80s is on the, over here. Oh, really? This was the pharmacy that had been in. Right here? Yep. So that's what it looked like when I was coming here as a little kid. Wow. How about for you? Okay. And there was a pharmacy back there. There's been ice cream on this corner since the 1930s. Yeah, I saw the sign for the farm. Is that the original sign for the pharmacy, or? Um, yeah, I think on the that side. On that side of the building. I think so. Okay, so yeah. since January, so yeah. they say you serve food too, like. I do. I just do one lunch special a day. So today I have a hamburger, wild rice hot dish with chips. What's a hot dish? Um, like a thick soup, kind of like casserole. Around here. I've heard that. I've, say casserole. I've heard that since I've been here. She hasn't made it for me. Um. <laughs> Minnesota hot dish is yeah, what it's called. Yeah, hot dish. Yeah, other places call it casserole. So it's like a mixture of 
things. I don't know how to describe okay. it. Okay. Yeah. Kind of like a goulash type. Yeah. Thing, like almost. A goulash or a, have you ever a tater tot hot dish? Yes. I so have made that. You can you make hot made... dish out of various things. Okay. Got you. Yep. All right. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, and that's what the building looked like in the 30s when it was a drugstore. Oh, let's check this out. Yeah, check it out. And then the song along the wall was written especially just for me. Was it really? Yeah, by the artist that did all the drawings and the paintings. And, it, and you can make up your own melody. If I was an ice cream cone, what flavor would I be? Does almond fudge and chocolate... Oh, wait, there's strawberry. Strawberries make me smile. Just like cold ice cream. I love to come to shoot with shooties. Yep. The best I've ever seen. They're the flavor for all people, for every size and shape. And one or two or three scoops, my tummy can't escape. I bring my friends and family to shooties every day. We laugh and we smile together. That's all I have to say. Shooties! Yeah, Marmalade and, um, let's see, Joe Curie yeah. was in it. And they filmed over in the corner there. They brought in some booths and um, he and his co-star, who is the ex-girlfriend of Leonardo DiCaprio, I can't remember yeah. the name. And they were here for a whole day um, filming and then they took over kind of other businesses in town. Or Finished. putting it together. Yep, yep, yeah, but it, it hasn't come out. Oh, it's a Netflix production. Okay. okay. So, Do yeah. you have? I was what's in your a, name? I was in a friend. Hey, friend. Yeah, because then I had my dog. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's all I have on that one. To the upstairs. Upstairs? You say no, you got what? The guy lives upstairs, doesn't he? Joel. Thank you for watching. This was a fun day. I would love to share more with you. Just tell me what you think in the comments below. Cheers.